Hi you winners, welcome back to some more Mass Effect 3. Last we played, Grunt almost died on us. That was not okay. And everyone talked to us uh, about issues they're having. One in particular we have to go address, two in particular we have to address. One is Anderson, I think, wants to talk to us, yes. And then we need to go talk to Morden and Eve, because I guess Morden wants to talk to us about something. So Anderson. Shepard. So I imagine by now you've wiped the galaxy clean of Reapers and we can all come up for air? Yeah, <laughs> not quite. There have been a few complications. Aren't there always? Hackett filled me in on the crucible. Sounds like you've got some knots to untangle. Let's find out more about Sanders. I'm just glad I could take care of one of them for you. I gather you and Kaylee Sanders were close? I owe you for that one, Shepard. Kaylee and I met almost 20 years ago. We even had a run-in with Saren in his early days. She and I were... more than close. Ooh. She misses you. I miss her. Oh. End of the world has a way of reminding you what you forgot to do. Maybe when the war's over, Kaylee and I will do something about that. You'll see her soon. I can hope. But you've got a bigger problem right now. Like a galaxy full of scared bureaucrats. <laughs> Part of the job. It's what you hired me to do. Mostly you were hired to kill Reapers. Yeah. I hope you haven't been sidetracked by all the politics. Nothing I can't handle. What about you? What's happening on Earth? I'll spare you the details. Hmm. But let's just say a lot of cities around the world have stopped checking in. Hmm. That bad? You and I knew what we were in for, but everyone else? I don't think the shock's worn off yet. Are you safe? That changes by the hour. Mm. I caught a shuttle leave at, out of Vancouver. And now we're running from Foxhole to Foxhole just trying to stay alive. What about the Reapers? They're harvesting everything that moves. They're focusing on the big cities, which does give us some room to maneuver. You think you can hang on? Hell, we're still just trying to talk to each other. Right now, all we can do is organize the resistance at a local level. No lack of volunteers, at least. Everybody knows what's at stake. We haven't forgotten you. I don't know how we'll win this yet, but we will. Even if it kills me. Well, you've already died once, and that didn't slow you down. But let's not tempt fate. Keep yourself safe, Shepard. You too, sir. We'll talk again soon. Anderson out. We better. Just saying. Okay. I got plus two to reputation. So let's go talk to... Because we haven't done his mission yet. Nor Rex's. Hi Rex, how you doing? Um, so they probably don't have much more to say. Oh, Rex might have something to say about Grunt. Let's see. Need something, Shepard? And never mind. <laughs> That's it for now, Rex. This is Let's awkward. Get back to work. Uh, yeah. Something wrong? Oh. Morden. He got his tissue sample from me. All right. Let's just say scalpels were never meant to cut where he cut. Ah! Did, did he slice his testicle? Just saying. That's what that kind of sounds like. To get a sample. To make babies. Just saying. When this war is over, I hope we find every race that sat back while we bled and get some payback. Damn. Yeah, that's a great plan. Follow war with more war. Yep. Commander. Cerberus is attacking civilians on Benning. We've been asked to help evacuate the planet. Benning! <gasps> okay, wait, let's see. N7 Cerberus abduction. Cerberus is attacking civilians on Benning. Land on Benning to provide protection while civilians are evacuated. So I can do that because it's not priority. So that's a little exciting, guys. That's a little exciting. There are two. That's the Chichunka one. Okay. I want to do this one because Benning, you guys, Benning. For anyone who doesn't know what Benning is, Benning! I want to find this dude's son, alive or dead. I don't care. Okay. So let's go talk to Morden real quick. Actually, let's go feed our fish real quick. Because fish. Let's do it. Nope. Did it work? It did work. Good. Just making sure. Okay. Um, crew deck. All right. Y 
I believe so. Yes. Let's find out things. What do you need, Martin? No. Shepard. Eve ready for travel to Tuchanka. Oh. Uh. Did I already say this stuff? Eve. How's she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. Oh, no. My people don't have time yeah, for that. We already did this. Her opinion, somewhat different. You're her friend. You care about her. My yeah. patient. My responsibility. Okay, we, we did honor. that already. She said, please. Um. What's the shroud? What can you tell me about the shroud? Climate regulator. Counteracts radiation damage to Tuchanka's atmosphere from nuclear war. Particles emitted from main tower form layer that mitigates ultraviolet bombardment, prevents atmospheric escape of necessary elements. Solarian work? And your people put it up? Yes, when uplift process began. Demonstration of goodwill to Krogan. Stabilize climate, impress population. <laughs> Combined with technological gifts, easy to gain Krogan support against Rachni. Legit. Curing genophage? You always defended your genophage work. Oh, okay. Never this change is... mind. Genophage process. Gotcha. circumstances. Reaper invasion. So... Mm. Feelings about data. So we did the right thing by saving the data. Indeed, would be much harder to treat Eve without. Okay, so monstrous. The only thing that was new purpose, was that victims one. didn't die so. for nothing. I, I thought you wanted to talk Morton. to us. We'll be here if you need me. Whatever. Continuing to study shroud in meantime. Okay. So he's studying a shroud. Hey, girl. Whoa. Something else, Commander. Never mind, I'm sorry. Seems like everything's Thanks not... for talking to me. <laughs> it's my pleasure, Commander. I love her. Okay, so I guess he didn't need to talk to me like I thought he did. So that's strange. Okay. I'm gonna talk to my bae. See if he has anything different to say. Um, where's my bae? Guys, where's my bae? He's always here. Where is he? Bay. Bay. Where you at? Curse. I'm concerned. He's never not doing calibrations. I don't like this. Where'd he go? Liara? Are you guys having an affair? They can't. They're not OTP. Have we found any new engineers for the Crucible Glyph? Five oh, Exonex good. Industries scientists who attempted to reverse engineer Prothean technology stolen from planet Garvuk. They are technically still wanted by the Council for hiding Prothean technology. As well, Sonax's part in instigating an illegal war on Garvuk. Oh. I'm sure the Council will forgive that for helping with the Crucible. Extend those scientists amnesty and an invitation. Right away. Hey, girl. Busy? I have time if you'd like to talk. In fact, I could use the distraction. What's on your mind? How long it took the Reapers to eradicate the Protheans, and how long they'll need for us. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. Hmm. We're not quite so widespread, but it would still take at least 100 years. Uh, it's selfish, ladylike. I keep thinking that if we fail, I'm only 109, Shepard. I could live to see the entire cycle come to an end. Oh, gee, that young? Only a hundred and nine, huh? I know, it must seem strange to complain about a thousand year lifespan. I used to think it was sad that most aliens live such short lives. Maybe it's not such a privilege to outlive so many, to witness so much death. The war's not over. Don't drive yourself crazy about this, Liara. We're still in the fight. Only because you're still driving it forward. We finally have other leaders on our side, but none will take us as far as you can. Sometimes I wonder how you do it. I have friends like you. I think of the people I care about. That helps keep me going. I'm glad I'm among them. I hope. You are. Of course you are. I feel better already. Aww. Thank you for coming by, Shepard. Why don't we talk later? Okay. Now he's cute. Available in... Ooh, warp unlocked. Okay. So, 
Hopefully that doesn't show up in the mother frickin' recording. So apparently Chrome really wants to show me my Facebook messages. Like, really bad wants to show me my Facebook messages. Even when I'm not logged in or anything. Or not, not that I'm not logged in, but when I don't have the window open. It's just like, oh hey, by the way, someone shared something with you. Thanks! I don't freaking care and I don't know how to get to stop. We thought we fixed it. Apparently not. Great. So, if there's a black box that randomly appears in the lower right hand corner of the screen, it's because of that. Um, so where's Garrus? I would really like to know. Please. Wasn't the first time. <gasps> Thank I you. Ragnime. Really? You've seen them before? A few years back, on Novaria, Saren and his minions were trying to extract information from the Ragnai Queen. You saw the Queen? Mm hmm. Hell, we spoke to her. We just saw her now. You spoke? I can't imagine that. The <laughs> things you've done, sir, they're amazing. Well, it didn't seem that way at the time. But mostly, you're just clawing your way out of one mess and into another, hoping your ass comes along for the ride. Yep. Hey, Garrus. I was trying to find you. Just one word, Shepard. Grunt. There'll be a lot more dead reapers now. Aww. That's cute. Let's see if we can find Grunt, actually, now that I think about it. Um, he... Ah, he wouldn't be with Javik again, I don't think. Because that'd be weird. It'd be a little weird if they were together. I, I just now realized I can't go into the men's bathroom. I can only go into the females. Hmm. Stop beating yourself up. It was crazy of me to ask you to join the Normandy back then. And we lost so many people. You might have been one of them. I couldn't have lived with myself. But I let you down. I let Shepard down. You didn't let me down. I let everyone listed on that memorial wall down. No, you didn't. You had the courage to support Shepard. Joker did. Garrus and Tally did. That's because Garrus is Ashley there. didn't. Liara didn't. Were they cowards? I think not. No. Greg, you're one of the bravest and most loyal men I know. Oh. You were meant to be here right now. We have a war to win, so clear your head and focus. <laughs> okay, okay, you win. It will not be mentioned again. Oh, Commander. That was so cute. Hello, Commander. That was adorable. Thank you, Chakwas, for uplifting them. You didn't have to, but you are, and I appreciate it very much. This is too fancy for Grunt. Okay, so I don't know where Grunt is. Um... Oh, actually, Med Bay. He might be in that back room. That'd make sense, seeing as he's freaking injured. Nope. Nope. No grunt. That's fine. I'm sure he was shipped somewhere and I didn't realize it, but I would like to make sure I don't miss an opportunity with grunt. So let's go to engineering. Oh! Oh! Sorry, I got really excited because I realized something. Um, so, apparently there's something down here that a couple people have told me about. I need this. I need this in my life. I need this. <gasps> Where? Ah! Come back! Come back, you little bitch! Where is it? So... I don't know if it just keeps running around. That's my hamster from the second game. Where? I can't like get a good lock on on him. Shit. <gasps> Did I get it? I think I got it. Ah, space hamster! Done. I have a space hamster now. I actually just saw a drawing of a uh, shepherd leaning over the bed to Garrus being like, Honey, go the hell to sleep, pretty much. And he's like, I know, but this guy, little guy wants to party. And he's got the hamster on his knee, and it's adorable. So cute. Sometimes keeping the grid balanced is pure murder. Murder. I like his accent. I can't do it. I'm not even going to try again. Okay. Hey, Javik. How you doing? Commander, I did not expect to face the Rachni in this cycle. But I am not surprised. You said you used them as weapons? Biological proxies. It was before I was born, but every Prothean had heard the stories. Hmm. 
When we knew of them, the Rachni spent their lives singing thoughts to each other. But our scientists were more interested in their biology. The Rachni were well suited to harsh conditions. Aww. So we bred them for violence, Aww. selecting the most cunning and warlike of the queens. Then we unleashed them upon our enemies. For a time, it worked. Until they became too cunning and warlike and turned on us. We put them down before they could develop any further. We thought they had been exterminated. Yet it seems our experiment evolved into this cycle's nemesis. I don't know. I like them. I like... Well, I like this queen. She's... She's a badass. She very much cares for her children. That's all I can ask for. So, I think the reporter's in here. Have you seen our newest crew member? You mean the biggest story in 50,000 years that I can in no way talk about? Say, so, yeah, I've seen him. Just wondering. Trainer. Oh, uh, she, she must be talking about Javik. Just curious. You know, in the old days, they didn't have automatic cameras. Reporters had to cake on the makeup. Oh. It's kind of cool. That that's what they're doing. Okay. So let's go to the bottom. Though I'm not, I don't think Grunt's anywhere on here. If he is, he's hidden. Um, but where's Cortez? Who was working over there last time? I did. Oh, is that you? Yep. Sir Kesh certainly offered me a new experience. What do you mean? Normally I'm not one to fly co-pilot, but when an 800 pound Krogan requests to take control of your shuttle, you comply. <laughs> Probably wise. That's true. Probably wise. Anyway. Let's go talk to James. We haven't heard anything from you in a while. I hear we're headed to Tachanka. Would love to see how things turn out. I'm just saying. I must flirt him with you. We're not having some good conversations. Makes me sad. So, I don't know where Grunt is. But, I guess we're gonna go do that N7 mission. Um. Oh, no! I should, ah! Uh, I should go to the captain's quarters and see if I can find the hamster. Thank you guys for telling me about that. Cause I did not know. <gasps> hamster! <laughs> That's so cute. Well, this is awkward. Okay. So, I'm thinking we should do that Cerberus one. Because I can't... Yeah. That's the only thing I could think of doing. I don't think I have any new messages. I didn't have time. So, let's do it, I guess. Okay. I probably missed something. It's how I roll. So, leave orbit. Needless to say. That sounded great. My cat knocked something over. Or or maybe not. Uh oh. Reapers. So what is this? Oh fuel. Or Intel? Intel from Battle Arctic Arctus? Uh Arcturus. Lying at the L5 Lagrangian point of Themis are the fused metal fragments of Ar Arcturus Station destroyed by Reaper capital ships. The station once housed the system's Alliance Parliament and the nerve center of their military armada. Now it is a cold grave for 45,000 people. Jesus. That sucks. Okay. So I'm guessing it's around here. Shut up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna piss them off. There we go. I pissed them off, but I found it. <laughs> the wreckage of a fuel depot. Cool. Okay. So let's leave. Oh. Super subductions. It better have been successful. Just saying. By the way, you guys can't ever hear because I have to keep muting. Excuse you. Um, this because of the song. But uh, Edie normally says evasion is successful every time that I outrun Reapers. So anything I don't think there can be anything because this is where something is it seems to be what's going on Benning 
Benning, the nearest garden world to Arcturus Station, is the primary source of its food supply and important staging area for starship maintenance and repair. Occupying the planet would be key in any attempt to retake the system's relay. A scattered intelligence indicates that during the battles of Arcturus and Earth, the Reapers sent a small force to Benning to destroy its convoys. Boys? Boy? Buoys? Buoys. Spaceports and starships. With the population immobilized and communications cut, the main force concentrated on the large, larger prize, and knowing that they could return before repairs could be made to help, or help could arrive. Heat sources in Benning space indicate a non-reaper presence here, uh, which is Cerberus. So there's all the information. Let's land. Let's do this thing. Yas. Okay, so we're gonna do Garrus. Uh, Benning. It's just gonna be fighting Cerberus. So pretty much any tech, and he's kind of part tech, so I should probably do Javik then. Yeah. Cause he's he's not full biotic. He's partly something else. Actually, let's see Edie fight. Let's let's see that. Let's do it. <laughs> let's see how this goes. I really want to see her fight. Okay, so I'm good with everything I have because I still haven't checked to see what I can do. Edie has pistols. Okay. Does she not have anything else? Sniper, she can do assault rifles. Or no, she can't, she can't do anything yet. Okay, cool, great. Um, ooh, I have seven. Uh, what is this? This is fire one power while cloaked and remain hidden. Ooh. Uh, increase sniper rifle damage by 40% while cloaked. Jesus. Um, fire one power while cloaked and remain hidden. I don't really fire other powers while I'm cloaked, so I'm going to go with damage. That seems great. Back. Okay. Edie, we have nothing for you. Unshackled AI. Let's do like all of these. Boost power damage, shields, barriers, and health. Increase health and shield and power damage. Same thing. Um, either increase power damage by 20 or health and shield by 20. We're gonna go with power damage. Go with tech power, tam power damage or weapon damage. We'll go with tech. And then increase squad mate tech power damage and duration by 10%. Um, or decrease shield charging. Recharge by 20%. Mm. I'm gonna go with this. So. And then we got a few of other things. I don't know, decoy? Ooh, distraction. I like distractions. Let's at least do one right now. Defense matrix. Reinforce armor, protective occult currents, purge the currents to restore shields. Slow down per use. Power use. Per use. Let's do two. Let's do two for this one too. Uh, increase recharge speed. Overload. So we're gonna need that. Uh, effective against shields, barriers, and synthetics. Not as effective against organics. We'll be fighting a lot of synthetics as Cerberus, right? Or reapers I don't know one or the other we're gonna do that and then incinerate uh, heavy damage to health and armor make an enemy panic stopping health regeneration really good we'll just make her well-rounded Garus, we're gonna make you Turian rebel increase power damage of squad mates by 10% or sniper rifle damage oh, we're gonna do that I'm gonna make you badass Okay. Confirm. Let's see what's on this planet. Shepard, Cerberus strike squads have infiltrated one of the major cities on Benning. Initial reports indicated they were recruiting civilians, but further investigations suggest that the people are being taken against their will. For what purpose? Unknown. We sent a recon team to investigate, and the Cerberus squads reacted by targeting civilians in public facilities. What's wrong? Officially, Cerberus is denying responsibility and condemning the action. They're either lying, or we're dealing with a rogue faction. And innocents are caught in their crosshairs. Exactly. Secure the area, 
so we can establish a rescue lifeline to the rest of the city. Approaching the drop point, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. The people down there are counting on you, Commander. Hack it out. I'm going. Oh. Building an avalanche of civilian SOS requests, Commander. The both are concentrated on the upper street. Very interesting. Cerberus forces are pinning them down. You better hurry. Okay. On my way. Keep me updated. Roger that. <laughs> it's Edie. Okay. Sorry, I'm very amused. Civilians are over there. I hope I'm not actually timed because I want to kind of search and make sure I don't miss anything for that dude about his son. That would suck. Yes. Okay. Anything? No? Okay. I hear a bunch of shooting. That's not reassuring. Hey. Hey. the fuck? Secure upper streets. There we go. Hey, buddy. Hey, turret. You're gonna blow up now. Thank you. Um, I want disruptor ammo. That's what's best for Cerberus. What? Excuse me. Fuck you. Okay. So I'm gonna run back in a second once I'm done securing this area. Fuck you. Hey, hey, ow. That's not cool. Where you go, Edie? Where are you? Well, that's majestic. Where? Edie's just finding everyone. Where's Garrus? Oh, there's Garrus. Doing a bunch of damage. Whoa, I almost walked in here. Okay. What is it, Lieutenant? Tracking civilians fleeing the city with Cerberus troops right behind. Okay. Well, Where are they? Hold on. Updating your nav point. You can intercept them there. Okay. Well, we'll do more than that. Ah, here is. Um, there's some civilians over here. Let's help them out over here. Hey, buddies. Where'd you go? There you are. Hey. Damn it gonna die in one shot, it's fine. Fuck you. There's nowhere to go. I got you. Look, reinforcements are yeah. here. Try to stay calm. What? What should we do? Just stay down. Oh. Commander, more service troops are heading your way. If you can hold the line there, it'll give the civilians time to escape. You heard him. We hold here. I'm so scared. I'll try not to have you guys die on my watch. I'd be super pissed if you do. No! No! How do I stop this? Okay, it doesn't matter. I'm so scared. That apparently did nothing to them. That's fine. Where? Where? There's some. Hey. Fuck you. You're fine. It's fine, girl. You are okay. Fuck you. Okay. Go, go, go. Defend them. Shit. I'm trying to. Cool the oh, thank you. Thank you, Gears. Fuck. Good. Don't let don't let her out of your sight. That works. That works too. Where? That's Edie. You're not going to die. My goal is to not have you die, thank you. Where? Help Fuck you. Us. I'm trying. Fuck you. Ow. Where? So there. No. Fuck you guys. I think we can make it out of here. You can. Fuck you, I got reload! Hey, buddy. Okay, guys. You guys gotta not run towards the enemies. I know. I use sniper a lot. Sorry, guys. That scares. Where? There we go. Where's more? 
They are everywhere. I'm sorry. I'm trying. That scares. us? Where? There. Well, they're not doing anything. Whoa! Shit. Fuck that. Fuck you. There we go. Oh, hey guys. Please don't run into the fucking fire! Okay, you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you. Where's the other one? Fuck you. Fuck you. Damn it. I missed that one. Hey. Hey. Ow. That was awesome. And not intentional at all. What? That was... Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Um, excuse you. That works too. Screw you. There are so many! And I swear to god, if this triggers it so that way I can't, like, explore... I'll be pissed. Because I have to defend the civilians right now. Where? There's so many dudes. Die. Where? Not anymore. Hey, buddy. You're kind of just floating there. You're clear. Go. Where are you going? Goddamn. Yes, you are. No hostiles detected in the immediate area, Commander. Good. Reinforcements are moving in to secure the evac route. Okay. Good work, everyone. I'll pick you up at the LZ, Commander. Okay. Can I explore before you pick us up? I would greatly appreciate letting me explore. Um, anything? This is where I ran into to first meet them. I swear to God, if I miss anything, I'm like mad. Okay. Ammo's full. Boom. I'll salvage that. Um, whoa. I ran into here earlier. Ooh. Run! To anyone reading this, don't trust Cerberus. They're taking people against their will. Just run. Whatever you do, don't look back. Run! Kai. I hope people listened. Other than these two. These poor two people. I don't know where everyone else is. Okay, let's see. Something here. PDA. Be careful, Nemo, if you read this. Stay away from the taxi stand. The place is crawling with Cerberus soldiers. Ellie. Okay. I salvaged credits. Stole from people, basically. Cool deal. Anything I can take? That's you. Nope. Don't claim me yet. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. I want to go up here. Shit. Shepard doesn't, but I do. Okay. I think I already went up here. I think this is one of the main areas. I don't think I went in here though. So let's see. Nothing. That's cool. Um, I think I went all the way around here already. Uh, is there nothing I missed? Really? Nothing. Do I not know anything about this dude's son? So really? Like to know something about him. Shepard hasn't. Or er, Shepard. Edie hasn't really said anything. I guess it's not a major plot point, but sad. Okay. Well, it looks like this is all. What was something was going over there? I think it's just ammo, though. <laughs> yeah, it's just ammo. But I'll run by it just in case. Yeah. Hey, Goth. Okay, maybe they're supposed to tell us, or maybe we're going to another area. One or the other. I already checked in there, so. You guys. 
That's it, I guess. Great. We're getting reports of continuing yes. strikes against other cities on Benning. Cerberus still denying responsibility? Yes, and for once we're inclined to believe them gunning down innocent humans isn't their usual M.O. Either way, the civilians down there have a chance now. We're solidifying the foothold and getting people out, then we'll move to liberating the rest of the planet. I hope we can say the same for Earth. One day, Commander. For now, we've got our work cut out for us. Carry on. Cerberus is easier to deal with than Reapers. So... I don't believe I found anything in any way relating to that guy's son. <sighs> Let me see if I can scan around the area. The area the evac another colony? We're losing a lot. Don't hear about the Reapers losing much. Of course. Well, Reapers don't have a home. Neither does Cerberus. If they did, Commander, True. Chief Engineer Adams would like to speak with you down in engineering. Why? That's concerning. And random. I don't like it, but why? What is going on? Are you Adam? Commander, remember Whoa. the problem I mentioned about a core overload possibly venting into the engineering compartment? Donnelly, Edie, and I have been brainstorming and comparing notes. You see, the venting occurs when IES sinks are in a back cycle at the same moment the main core is at peak draw, such as from sustained kinetic. What Engineer Donnelly means to say is that we're confident we can make the system safer. That's good. We just need a GX-12 thermal pipe. Unfortunately, we're cut off from Alliance supply chains. Could you keep an eye out for one the next time you're on the Citadel, Commander? I've got the specs right here. Why do I need this? Are these modifications really necessary? It's a safety issue, not exactly critical. Under extreme conditions like heavy bombardment to the kinetic barriers while traveling at peak flight speeds, plasma can vent into this compartment. It would vaporize anyone standing in this room. That sounds more serious than just a safety issue. Oh, but Well, under those conditions, odds are you're about to lose the entire ship anyway. <laughs> but we should take every advantage we oh, can but. get. I'll look for one the next time we go to the Citadel. Thanks, Commander. I'll try to remember. Shit. I'm really bad at remembering stuff. Oh, okay. Well, at least it's in my journal. So that's good. Because they're all... Knowing my memory, that's probably not going to happen. Okay. So... Okay. Good to know. My project. They are to Sony. Shepard, I've been working on something I'd like to show you. Can we meet in your quarters when you have a moment? They are... Why are we meeting in my quarters? I'm going to save. And after it's done saving, I will invite Liara. Liara, you had something you wanted to discuss in my cabin? Yes, I'll be right up. What is that? Come on in. Thank you. Could we sit? Are you okay, girl? I've been thinking about the knowledge we gathered on the Reapers and how easily it could be lost again. So, I put a plan in motion to preserve things for the future. What's this? A record of the galaxy. Information on the Reapers, relays, different cultures, and blueprints of the Crucible. Wow. But there's one entry I wanted your opinion on. Which one? The one of you. Your own. Oh. I'd be honored to have your input. How would you like history to remember you? 
You sure it'll last? 50,000 years is a long time for a computer to sit around. Please, I was an archaeologist. I know what I'm doing. I'm encasing these records in time capsules and seeding copies on multiple planets. And while it's not foolproof, the VI I'm installing has every translation and linguistics program I could find. So it's an information guide like Vigil on Ilos? Yes. I've been preparing it for some time. And it will be a privilege to guide the future discoverers of these records. Have you decided what you would like Dr. Tassoni to write in your entry, Commander? Wow. I'd like her to decide. You know me well enough to fill in the blanks, Liara. Are you sure? I trust you. Yeah. I'd like it to be your call. All right. Let's begin with the fact that Earth's most famous officer was born and raised in space. Shepard was also a deadly tactical fighter. Most enemies never saw her coming. <laughs> she was a soldier and a leader, one who made peace where she could. And it was a privilege to know her. Careful this doesn't sound like a diary. <laughs> I can't help myself. You're a good friend, Shepard. So are you. You've been there for me too, Liara. No, I haven't. I wish I could have joined you back on Ilium. It's okay. You made up for it. Well, I suppose I did just write your name in the stars. <laughs> so cute I was not ready for that that was really cute <laughs> oh Liara you just made me really happy I'm gonna feed these fish ah uh, I'm okay oh that was so cute See if trainer says anyone else wants to talk to us. Nope. Okay, that was really damn cute. Ah, uh, I can't handle that. Okay. <sighs> Sorry, I didn't mean to blow into the microphone. Okay, we're. I'm gonna pull pull it together. Uh, I'm gonna scan around Benning. We'll see if anything's there. Otherwise, I'll go run back to the Citadel and see if that what I if I found what I needed to. We'll see. It doesn't look like I can scan anything here. Uh, tears. <gasps> oh! What is this? Wreckage. Wreckage of a fuel. Oh. Okay, that's it here, I guess. Okay, well, let's go talk to the dude and see if we have anything about his son. What is this? What is this? Oh, this is the station. What is that? Oh, that's a... Gotcha. A uh, planet. Was it? Weren't Reavers here a second ago? They're not here anymore. Okay. Let's see if the guy... Sorry. Eh. Um... If anything of what we That's it. That's all that was on binning. Binning. I looked. Okay. You're Where's clear to dock, do? Normandy. Do you need ground transport? That dude is where? Mm, he is at the embassies. I need to get to the embassies. I believe. Yes, Commander. And then I'll just leave if he's no no use to me. Yeah, this is where I wanted. Hey. Yeah. Tell me you have found my son. Not yet. My apologies. If it's possible that my son's alive. Cerberus forces have reportedly attacked a Solarian medical. I'm guessing this has still has to be after Tachunka. That's my guess. But next I will do it looks like another Cerberus thing is available. So I'll probably try and do that. Otherwise, I will continue. I'm sorry, honey. I didn't want you to worry. 
Chances are, I'll never even need to put on armor. I know, and I'm sorry. That's what you get for marrying a civilian. Are you and the girls going to be okay? Combat pay isn't as much as I make at the dig site. We'll be fine. The last thing I want you to worry about is paying the bills. Just don't go too crazy with new dance classes, okay? I was in the drop those. I can't get the girls there on time, and I was probably gonna go pick up an extra shift at work. Oh. Well, we'll make it up to the girls when I get back. Dance classes, biotic gymnastics, I can keep her. whatever they want. Oh, that's super sad. Oh, I was told to listen to the conversation. Shit. Um, in the hospital, those two Asari that were talking, um, I was told that I actually might really like Welcome the backstory and it's a, pretty the interesting with solution. them. Sounds like it's probably gonna be sad, but they didn't say anything about it, so I'm going to just check it out. See if they have anything Memorial else to Hospital. say. We were deployed to Tiptree. It's a small human colony. We were supposed to help with evac. The enemy was landing. Just scouts, the Turian things, a few of the big ones. We were spread over half the continent, getting colonists to shuttles, wiping out husks. It sounds like you were doing good work. Could I have a gun? I'd feel a lot better. Just tell me what happened at Tiptree. Okay, so she'll be telling her story over time. Scary. So she wants a gun because I think she feels Welcome unsafe. Commander Shepard. One moment, with please. she's got PTSD. Clearly, like she's in the hospital for a reason, but I think she has severe PTSD. Now it seems like she's really twitchy. But I don't know if that's also the you know, programming and graphics. But she seems very twitchy. She really wants a gun. She does not like humans. And she was at a human colony. So I'm really curious as to what happened there. But I believe I will be doing uh, another mission. Her head is tilted in a weird way. I'm going to save because that, that Liara thing was just so worth it. Um, and then if that's pretty quick, then I'll be doing something on Tachanka. So I hope you guys are winning life and I'll see you for that. Let's keep winning, guys. Bye.